our Senate Lady Defenders. Let's start with our team captain at number three, Jamie Dili Dili. At number 11, Candice Cerezo. At number 12, Jesse Vinluan. At number 13, Marvi Felipe. At number 19, Grace Palabrica. At number 20, Sheila Cecilio. Your starting libero, number 9, Franz Torres Roque. Head coach, Mr. Roger Gorayev. Calling on our Department of Foreign Affairs emissaries. We we'll start with our team captain at number 16, Mitch Olavere. At number 3, Min Cruz. At number 5, Aura Acosta Capili. At number 8, Marge Pepito. At number 17, Robbie Baltazar. At number 19, Cheng Aparientos. And their starting libero, number 6, Jane De Leon. Head coach of the Avisaries, Mr. Butch Gandarosa. This is match number 9 of the UNTV Volleyball League. Good luck to both teams. Starting lineup, man. Senate Lady Defenders of Coach Roger Gorayeb. Grace Palabrica coming off a 14 point performance. Cecilio, 24 points. Samantala DFA Emissaries. Charmaine Cruz, 4 points lang in their last game. Yung Talo contra sa Judiciary after pulling up 29 in their first game. The other player, or the only player in double digits nung loss na yon, Margarita Pepito with 16 points. You know, sabi nga ni Coach Boche, um, ang DFA, they didn't have a system in the last two uh, games that they played. Ngayon, nag-establish sila ng system. So, he's hoping na kung anong na-train nila, lalabas ngayon. At saka, siguro ang ganda nung nangyari sa training, ano? Because he was saying it repeatedly nung interview yeah. ni Rina Camara na sana lumabas yung oh. ginawa namin sa practice. Sana lumabas yung ginawa oh. namin sa practice. When I talked to him kanina, sabi niya, ang ganda daw na nangyari sa training nila. So, I'm excited. I'm sure. Oh. At dami DFA dito sa likod natin. Hindi eh. ko nung oh, okay. introduce yung starting lineup, maingay sila. So, oh. I'm sure they're excited as well. Yes. Kung anong gagawin. Looking for their first win, the MSRIs taking on the Lady Defenders ng Senado. And we're off. And Cecilio. Uh, attack error para sa unang putos ng emissaries. You know, that's a good first uh, point from DFA kasi it came from a serve. Out of system yung play ng Senate at hindi na naitawid yung bola. The service ace para kay Cruz. And nagwawala yung crowd dito sa likod natin. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> wow, may drums pa. <laughs> so, I mean, Cruz mula sa San Sebastian, one of the four imports, pero tatlo lang ang available today. Dahil yun nga, si Larmy may injury. Larmy Ramirez will not be available para sa DFA emissaries today. Cecilio. And that's the first attack point para sa Lady Defenders. Yeah, one of the go-to players of the Senate is Cecilio. So if she's in front, tsaka si Dili Dili. So if they're in front, you can expect attacks coming from them. Candice Cerezo. The set para kay Cruz. The tip by Pepito. Uh, back row attack. Good save. Uh, several over balls. Ito, atake, karandang. Pepito. Well oh, saved good. by Palarga. Wow. And Cecilio gets it across the net. Olar, Olavero, tira with the bola. Cecilio. Outside. Yeah, quickly apologizes to Coach Roger. What a crowd, huh? And si Coach Roger Garayev, napatayo. At uh, oh. para may sinabi kay Cecilio ang tungkol sa palo niya. Oh, kasi ito sa ilalim siya eh, kanina. That's why si Coach Roger just saying, siguro huwag kang umilalim. 
para service error mula kay Robbie Baltasar. Emisaris naman ang isa. Three serving two. Oh, make that three all. Service ace. Mula kay Catherine Villegas. Ah, sorry. That is Mamarvi Felipe. Mahirap yun ha yung ginawa niya. It's a short serve. Short serve, ano? Yeah. Marvi Felipe, back-to-back one-point performances para sa Lady Defenders dito sa ating torneo. Pepito with a push. Pinangat. Di dili-dili. Pepito ulit. Yes! You know, Cecilia was in front of her, pero si Pepito nagawa niya ng paraan. Ang ganda ng wrist action niya dun sa palo niya na yun, kaya bumaon yung bola. Pepito. 16 points ng kanilang hulig na rin. Right now, Pepito with her first point. Dili-dili. Attack error. So that was a good setup. Unfortunately lang, medyo mababa yung kamay niya. Kaya tumama sa net. Manapapansin mo na ba, Chiki, yung improvement niya sa practice as Olavere? Tagal mo na. Oh, rotational. Rotational error. Tawag sa emissaries. Pero napansin mo na ba yung improvement nila? What have you seen so far? Sa DFA? Oh, they're moving. They're, uh, parang alam nila ngayon kung saan sila dapat tumayo, anong zones nila. And they're moving accordingly. Cruz, umatake mula sa back row. Felipe, inangat. Palarka, tumalo. Good call. Felipe, ito si Dili Dili. Standing spike. Mula kay Acosta Capili. That hit is outside para kay Palabrica. Ang DFA, I think, na-iingganya din sila. Dahil ang dami na lang cheerers from the features. 2.3 para sa emissaries sa opening set. Margarita Pepito. The only player in double digits. Sa talo ng emissaries, service outside. Good eye there by the Senate. They followed the ball, nakita nila, labas, tsaka lang nila, linak go yung bola. Pero serve din. May dili-dili, goes outside. Two-point game. It's a slow start sa parehong kuponan, ano? So many errors committed. Felipe inangat. Palabrika, papalo. Mas Pepito will be up. Short! Ayun, talagang puro errors tayo sa palimula. Doon na nakakaputo sa parehong kapulan, actually. Miss hit doon si... Only one attack per team. Si Pepito, miss hit doon. Only one attack per team. Oh, wow. Eh, nakaka-7-6 na tayo dito. Outside. Oh, service. Oh, she's Clearly right. outside, pero sinagot ni Aparientos. And that is outside mula kay Cerezo. Another error. <laughs> I'm sure na titinig niya through oh. our microphones. Let's go, DFA. For sure. Dili-dili. Maganda yung pasa. Felipe Inangat. Palabra ka. Pepito with the dig. Malabere, kakaposig yan. Oo. Malapit yung wow. bola sa net. Talagang, yun ang baligan dito, no? Error ng isa. Papunta sa isa, and vice versa. Again. Let's see if Palabrica can string up some service aces for her team. Palabrica with a good serve, Olavere. Cruz, back to Olavere. That is just... It's on the line. It's on the line. Wow. Yan ang hirap nga eh. Kapag long yung mga attacks, long hits, talaga magdadalawang isip na kung kukunin mo ba yun or hindi. And that one really hit the line. Two-point lead. 
para dito sa MSRIs. Simon Cruz. Ooh. Wow. Matala, Cerezo. Magsaserve. Can this Cerezo to tie the game? Not a good first ball. Mula kay De Leon. And it's gonna be an ace para kay Cerezo. As she ties it at 9-0. Pero ang ganda talaga nung sinabi kanina ni Coach Roger na porket ang kalaban ni Efe na wala pang panalo, hindi sila dapat, you know, um, they still need to work hard because gusto nila manalo. Palabra ka yun nga, Felipe, to dili-dili. No, actually, napunta kay Cecilio, pero Cecilio, actually, napatawid na sa middle line, hindi na natawagan. Cruz to Pepito. Yun nga, ni dili-dili. Cecilio. Pepito with the first touch. Cruz. Olivera. Felipe, longest rally so far. Dili Dili with a push. Cruz in a nut. Olivera will play setter. And the uh, touch. It's a tower case, Cecilio. Ganda nga ng movement. Pakikita mo eh, na yung kaibahan between this, this uh, DFA compared to the past DFA that we've seen play. Puntahan natin itong report ni Ira Pablo. Two players from the DFA emissaries are going to miss out the game today. Isa na dyan si Larni Ramirez, binanggit na kanina ng ating game correspondent na si Rina. Because of an Achilles tendon rupture, ang isa naman dyan, literally si Pat Cortez, she forgot her suit. Naiwan niya yung kanyang jersey and there's no way to get it all the way here in Paco Arena dahil manggagaling pa siya sa Laguna. But you know... These players are coming in with a new and improved system. Banggit nga ni Coach Butch kanina. So hopefully that will be enough to power them through this game. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat. Wow. Ayan, Larmy Ramirez is an import from La Consolacion College in Manila. Samantalang si Paz Cortez is a consul. Grabe yun, no? I mean, dumating ka dito and then you realize, ah, wala oh. yung jersey. Yung sakit nun, diba? Sayang, sayang pati. Sarap pa ba niya maglaro? Umuulan oh. nila, no? Papawis. Emissaries, lamang ng isa. 10 serving 11, Felipe. Pinawid ang bola. Picked up by Pepito. Cruz, back to Pepito. That lands on the line. May konting tulog mula sa net. You know, one of the changes that I have seen here sa DFA, si Cha Cruz. Charlene Cruz is the one serving as a setter. Kaya rin naman niya yun eh. Kasi beach volleyball player eh. So she, she's used to putting that ball up for a hitter. So far, adjustments. Coach Gandarosa working as almost, yes it is, a service ace. Blanca Olivera. Nice serve there from Olivera. Underhand yun na, pero nagkagulo ang defense ng Senate. A timeout, si Coach Roger Gorayev. They are down by three, biggest lead para sa emissaries. Pakikin natin. Bumaba ka rito, bumaba ka dyan, umisip ka, di ba? Yung sinasabi ko sa inyo kanina eh, ang nasa isip mo, open sa, wala pa tayong open sa hin kasi wala pa tayong reception. Tapos pag sumalo ka, huwag pa ilalim. Ang sama ng open sa natin, open sa natin, mas open sa natin, masama. Ora, ha? Well, masama talaga ang opensa ngayon. Uh, there's no denying. Uh, one attack point pa lang para sa defenders, oh, sa lady wow. defenders dito sa opening set. Samantalang meron na at least four attack points naman ang Ebesaris. Ang sabi nga ni Coach Roger, di ba? Receive first para magkaroon ng opensa. So, tingnan natin, no? Kung yung timeout na yun, na-disrupt ba yung momentum ni Olavere? Oh. Team Captain Michelle Olavere, mga two points siya. Dun sa three set loss contra sa judiciary. Uh, our second referee, Irish Santos, may inaayos with the technical committee. Uh, thumbs up. May nakita natin, so everything is good to go. Alright, Olavere serving MSRI's lamang ng tatlo. Palabra ka inangat. Felipe will set it to Cecilio. Good save by Acosta Kapili. But Cecilio, mga bilis yung reaction sa net. Oh, 
ball. Kapili when she brought, put that ball up. It was a good save. Kaya lang, it was perfect for Cecilia to hit. It's a two-point game. Marie, Sheila, Cecilio. Naglaro ito para sa Coast Guard sa V-League. As an import para sa Senate Lady Defenders. Acosta Kapili. Sula yung uh, angat niya. Little two-point run ng Lady Defenders all from Cecilio. And isa na lang hinahabol dito ng Senado. Cruz to Pepito. Ganda nung big ni Sarezo. Cruz back to Pepito. Nice. Doon palagi tinatarget ni Pepito yung palo niya kay Sarezo. Oh, know your opponent. Know the strengths and weaknesses of your opponent para alam mo kung saan dadalhin yung bola. So napigilan ng emissaries itong run ng Lady Defenders. Lamang uli sila ng dalawa. Dili Dili. Oh, wow! Oh, tatlong players na kapalibot din sa bola at walang kumabol o kuha ng second touch. Napatalot-taloy si Coach Butch Ganda Rosa dito sa sideline. <laughs> Cruz. Ito si Pipito. Papalo. Back row. Inangat ni Palabrica. And no third touch. Hindi maganda yung pasa ni Felipe. O pag hindi maganda yung unang pasa, mahirap na eh. Mahirap na to set up for an attack. Rachel Abarientos serving para sa emissaries. Felipe, palabrika. Nice One try. hand and dig mula kay Abarientos. Good reaction. Serenzo to Cecilio. Inangat kay Olavere. Cruz. Pepe Cecilio with a dig. Palabrica. Olavere, hahabol si Pepito. Cruces, ako na. That could have been outside. Kinuha ni Cecilio. Eh, Palabrica with a push. Inangap ni Pepito. Pepito, back row with a push. Palabrica, asking for it. Off speed. That's it. Kanina pa talaga yan. Ha? Even in the previous games, in Zone 6, talaga ang daming puntos na kukuha ng isang team when they put the ball there. Look at that. It's an off-speed hit right down to the middle. Ganda nung pasa ni Palabrica sa depensa ng emissaries. And Senado, Kentai on this serve by Vinluan. Cruz. The hit by Acosta Capili. Felipe to Palabrica. Yes! And Palabrica ties the game. Good setup there by Felipe. And Palabrica loving that setup. Ang, ang layo din kasi ng approach niya, no? So she built up the momentum for that hit. Palabrica has the last two points. The Lady Defenders time out on emissaries. It is a 5-1 run para sa Lady Defenders at yung biggest lead ng MSRs na lima na wala na. No, kailangan talaga ng DFA ngayon pag-aralan no, yung positioning din ng kalaban nila para alam nila saan mang manggagaling ang attacks. Binluan with the serve. Pepito magsiset para kay Cruz. Ganda ng take ni Tili Tili. Cecilio Olavere. Pepito back to Cruz. Di maganda yung uh, kuha ni oh, Binluan. Good save. A good save here. Felipe sends it over underhand. Chance ball para sa emissaries. Cruz! Natalo sa Joust with Palabrica. Free ball. Hinatid ni Abarientos. 
What a save by Cruz. Yeah, hati ni Pepito underhand. Chance ball. Lady defenders. Palabrega with a tip. Cruz in the Acosta Capini back to Cruz. Into the net. And Lalaban. Ang Lady Defenders. 16-15. Grabe, ang dami sa atin dito. We weren't breathing. Itingnan natin ang mangyayari next. From Pepito committing that mistake. She's a little bit under the ball. Pero you can understand kasi she's all over the place setting up the ball for Pepito. Binduan with a nice serve. But a good receive by Olavere. Cruz. Felipe, yaangap. Ito si Palabrega. Yes! Palabrega with three points. Nice placement there by Palabrega. There was a big gap between the defenders of the DFA. And lalabang na ng dalawa dito ang Senado. This is their biggest lead of the match. Binluan nagsaserve. Oh, sure. Uh, service error. Para kay Binluan, yeah, it's a one-point game. Lakang pa rin sila ng isa. Costa Capili will serve. Palabrica to Cecilio. Yes! Ang ganda nung ano, reach ni Cecilio doon because ano eh, she took that ball with a running with a run so meron siyang momentum hitting that ball. Puntahan natin si Ira Pablo. Eric and Chiki, pinanggit nyo nga kanina that uh, Kat Villegas has seen limited minutes during their last game against Ombudsman. And the reason behind that is Coach Roger is extra tough on her. Dahil nga, player siya ni Coach Roger dati. At siya pa yung nag-recommend uh, na ipasok dito sa uh, si Kat Villegas sa team. So, you know, yung expectations niya kay Kat, pagpasok niya, gumawa ng slight error automatic that will not do for Coach Roger. But of course, he's managing his expectations when it comes to the other players. Hindi daw niya masigawan yung iba katulad ng pagsigaw niya sa mga collegiate players niya dahil he has to be extra understanding dahil again mga empleyado nga most of our players. So you know, Coach Roger is managing his expectations when it comes to different players and all of them have different roles to play. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat sa report. Ira, yes, uh, si Kat Villegas played for Coach Goreyev sa San Sebastian. Coach Goreyev we mentioned 11 time champion. Uh, NCAA with San Sebastian as Pepito scores. And then an arm swing with Pepito. Let's look at that again. An underhand set up there by Chuck. Wow. Alam mo yung target na end line. Ang hirap gawin nun. You can only master that through training and experience. Cruz looking to tie with an ace. Yes! 19 all. Cruz with two points, all from Aces. What a tight game dito sa opening set sa pagitan ng Lady Defenders ng Senado at ng Emissaries ng DFA. Cerezo. And a hit by Cecilio. Pepito. Felipe sets it. Off speed mula kay Cecilio. What a dive mula kay Pepito. Abarientos, yahatid, underhand, nag-agawan kay Olavera. That's a side-out error. Kung ikaw yung nag-dive, tapos na out of bounds yung third ball, parang ang sakit para sa'yo nun eh. Pero I'm sure babawi ang DFA for Pepito. Ang mga senado ng isa, Cerezo. Good serve, Olavera. Pinangat ni Cruz, Pepito on the attack. Palabrega. Here's Felipe, sets it up for Cecilio. Outside. And look at the crowd. Hello, the Paco Arena. Umulan, umaraw na dito sila sumusuporta sa kanilang paborito ng ahensya. And they were, they're not disappointed because the first set palang tong ganda na yun lapit ng ng fight. The serve by Robby Baltasar. Dili dili. Pepito inangat. Cruz, sabi niya, ako na magsiset. Pepito, papalo. Yes, on the line. Emisaris, lalaman ng isa. 21-20. Ganda ng pagkalihis ng palo ni Pepito. Getting that sideline. Let's take another look. Pepito. Yes, kasi may blocker sa harapan niya. Avoiding it. Produce that point. Lagay-lagay niyo lang. 
Si Merch nakakapalo yung talaga. Sinabihan ko na kayo, pag dumikit ang bola nun, bitiin niya talaga eh. I-spread mo yung black mo sa kanya, ha? Isipan natin ang maigay. Lamang na naman eh. Mag-iwas tayo ng error sa service. Mag-iwas tayo, ha? Uh, that's the last time out to Coach Roger Gurayev, Chiki. Yeah, you know, he was correcting lang yung mga palo kasi yung attacks nila kaya lumalabas na sa ilalim sila ng ball eh. So, uh, ano lang yun, fix the approach because the height of the ball is okay naman. Tapos ano, sabi nga eh, bantayan si Marge, but know your opponent. Know kung ano yung mga gusto nila. Pag malapit sa net, sigurado yan. Itiin na si Marge. Good attack para kay Cecilio. To get the side out, Cecilio with six points, top scorer para dito sa Lady Defenders. We're tied at 21. Matala, Felipe. With the serve. Cruz, may hirapan siya rin. Dikit na dikit sa net, eh. Oh, hindi siya pwede tumanan kasi backliner siya, eh. Lalabang ang Lady Defenders on a two-point run. Director Felipe with her second serve. Pepito nag-angat. Pepito papalo. It's outside. It was a good idea going to zone one. Kaya lang it just went wide. Third error para kay Pepito. And dalawa kalabangan dito ng Senado. They are on a three-point run. Good serve. And a bad first ball mula kay Pepito. Pepito adjusts with a push and scores! Yeah, not all hits should be strong. Diba? Yung iba, pwede mong gamitan ng off-speed. Yung iba, pwede mong i-tip lang. Ang importante, the ball kisses the floor. Palavere serving. Chance to tie. Makakuha siya ng A.O. Inside. Ah, pakalayo. Hindi pa tumatawag din it. Alam mo na lang kasi. Alam mo na. Nabasa mo na. So, two set points. Lady Defenders, 24. Serving 22. Cecilio, short. And ito yung sinabi ni Coach Gorev sa last time out niya. Iwasan natin yung service errors. And Cecilio, isa sa kanyang mga imports. Madami nga silang service errors in the set. Dami. Apat. Apat na service error. Samantala, tatlo lang para sa emissaries. Pepito. Nice serve. Cecilio nag-angat. Easy ball. Pagkakataon ng matake. Cruz sa hitna. Yes! Two set points. Save. Napapalakpak si Coach Gandarosa as we're tied at 24. First set pa lang to, Eric. Nice approach there. Nice hit by Cruz. First attack point by Cruz. She has three points. Another great serve by Pepito. Good save. Another chance. Umatake. Cruz na sa gitna ulit. Yes! A two-point run. Arm swing pa lang eh. Ni Cruz, alam mo nang maganda yung bola niya. Look at this arm swing. It's a full one. Oh, we didn't see it there, but dito, it was a full arm swing, it was a fast one, and that's why that ball went down that way. Natawag ng reinforcement si Coach Roger Guerrier, Kat Villegas, in the game for the first time. Pero si Pipito sabi, isa na lang! Isa na lang kailangan natin. First set point para sa emissaries, 25-24, opening set. Pupunta sila, Kat Villegas, Villegas, easy ball. Cruz will set it. At Villegas, kukuha dito. Villegas with a push. Acosta Capilli with a nice dig. Cruz mula sa gitna. Cerezo, malakas. Nice save by Villegas. Cruz again. Sinuntok ang bola. Cerezo in a nut. Look for Villegas to attack. Villegas. Pepito, long rally. A very exciting one. Pepito, mula sa likod. Villegas sets it up. Muntik na matawagan. Walang pinito doon. Nagtataka si Coach Gandarosa. There's a block. Oh! Villegas off the bench with a point to tie the game at 25.
Taken by our boss, Max Three. He got block of the game, Cat Villegas. And then the hook of Coach Roger, huh? Okay, Cat Villegas. Punta sa gansha. Dili Dili with the serve. Oh, a poor first ball. And yeah, the service ace. Dili Dili. Binalik. Ang Senado at set point. And si Coach Gatarosa will use his last timeout. Pakinggan natin. So after losing two set points, balik sa set point ang Senado. This is set point number three. Jamilin Dili Dili with a nice serve. Cruz with a bad receive. Oh! And Pepito, hindi na itawid ang bola. And Senate, pwede natin tawagin come from behind win that they were down a set point as well. Yeah. Here in the opening set. It's just unfortunate that set ended with an unforced error. Pero I'm sure babawe ang DFA niya sa second set. Senado, they are led by Cecilio with seven points. Samantala ng DFA, top scorer nila, seven din. Para kay Pepito, as we take a look at some of the highlights, what an exciting opening set, yeah. Chiki. Grabe ang, ang tatagal ng mga rallies, and we saw a lot of hits na ang kakaiba yung mga angles, mahirap kunin because it was on the sideline or on the backline. Ayan, no, mga long hits like that with Palabrica. And ang ganda nung ano, eh, no? hindi, kahit na hindi overhead yung set ni Felipe, underhand siya, it was perfect for her hitters. So the opening set, going to the Lady Defenders. Uh, and Emissaries down one set to nothing going into set number two. Sa Paco Arena and an exciting opening set as the defenders, lady defenders, had two set points. Na bawe na emissaries, pero in the end they came up with the win. May kita natin, no? Very close yung mga figures because it ended in 27-25. Nagkatalo lang talaga sa serve receiver, so uh, they really need to watch out for the heavy serves 
that they should be able to control. Ito si Kat Villegas, pinasok na dito sa, ano, tsaka si Jewelay. Ito yung dalawang imports ng Senate ngayon. And they mean business. Diba? They, they want to get the second set. Also in the starting lineup para sa Senado, they have Enid. Number 14, Rachel Enid. And number 4, Joanne Pangilinan. Kasama si Ellen Pantanosas, number seven, yung the tallest player nila. I'm guessing she's gonna be the middle blocker oh. para dito sa Lady Defenders. Oh, mukhang diagonal sa ni Kat Villegas. Oh. Pero kapuna po na nawala si Pepito in the lineup of the DFA. Uh, Jackie Lou Waga, along with Charity Bejarin, yan ang uh, two new players on the floor. Kasama si Eileen So, number 12, isang import. Yeah. Si So, uh, yeah. Sio? So? Sio. Oo, oh. Sio. Eileen Sio. Yeah, Eileen Sio. Alam mo, ano siya, go-to player sila. Siya. So, babantayan yan dapat ng Senate. Kasi two imports lang ang pwedeng magsabay at Correct. any given time. Sure. Kaya, yun ang uh, ginawa si Cruz, Charmin Cruz, and Eileen Sio. Oh, oh. Para dito sa emissaries, samantalang Kat Villegas and Jewel Lai. Para dito sa Lady Defenders. Uh, Lady Defenders po, nakaputi. With the blue stripe, samantalang in blue with white stripe, ang um, emissaries ng DFA. Pantanosas will serve to kick things off. Sio with a nice receive. Olavere, attacks. Jewel Lai inangat, Villegas. Jewel Lai. Ito si Villegas again. Pinangat ni Sio. Cruz to Waga. Waga. Pick up. Wala kay Jewel Lion. Kat Villegas with the point. Kat Villegas is a go-to player of the Senate. She doesn't just hit the ball in the attacks, pero offensive blocker din siya. Kat Villegas, 28 years old. The second point of the game, first attack point para kay Kat Villegas yun. Cruz is blocked by Villegas. And this time, Villegas papaluan and Cruz. Last touch. That's what I mean. When Kat Villegas is in front, you can expect offensive hits at the net. Blocks niya. Nako, yung mga jaws. Yan. Kailangan oh. bantayan niya ng DFA. 2-0 start para sa Lady Defenders. Cruz. Villegas with the first touch. The set hindi maganda. Mula kay Enid. And the dig goes outside. Mula kay Pangilina. That's a good cross court here. Hit there. Good arm swing once again. No? Ang ganda ng buwelo niya eh. First point. And uh, Emissaries dito sa set 2 Mula kay Charmaine Cruz The serve is good Olivera The oh, save by Gallares Olivera, inangat Waga will set it Punta sila kay Cruz Nakalusot sa block Ni Villegas And Cruz will tie the game at 2 Now si Cruz no uh, When she's in front Kahit na may blocker Napapasok niya yung ball eh. Napapasok niya kasi kung paano niya uh, aanggulohan yung kanyang mga palo. Jackie Luwaga with the serve. Villegas! Nice. That was a good hit. Tinamahal niya yun from the top of that ball. Siya na nag-receive. Ang ganda nung setup ni Jewel Ay. Yan ang product nun. Senado, laban ng isa. Three, two. Fami Rexy Gallares. Oh, what a throw. Sio, inangat ang bola. Kat Villegas, yes, back to back points. Quickly apologizing si Kat, no? Kay Jewel, kasi Kat sumabot sa net, eh. It hit the tape. But it still earned the point. Two straight points para sa Lady Defenders. Four serving two. Gallares. Oh, oh, good save. Chance ball para sa Senado. Villegas with a tip. And, oy! 
Double point back at the kay Jewel Lai. Ganda na sa ganun. Oh, okay. Ang bilis ng mata ng referee, no? <laughs> so, natapos sa two points yung run ng Lady Defenders. Giliagas, pinabayaan kay Pangilinan ni Bola. Good save para kay Cruz. But uh, easy over mula sa emissaries. Giliagas. Nice. Yes! And to think si Villegas, if I'm not mistaken, two years nang stop siya mag volleyball. And it seems like muscle memory. Eh? Oh, oh. Balik sa two points sa kalamangan ng Lady Defenders. They're on a two point run. Reserved by Enid. It's too strong. Good eye there by the emissaries. Isa na naman ang hinahabol dito ng MSRs, Fermin Cruz, serving 4-5, set 2. And a bad to see by Torres Roque. Service ace para kay Cruz and the game is tied at five. Dito sa second set. Doon tinatagi talaga ni Sarbin Cruz. Chance ball. Waga sets it. Palo ni Sio mula sa likod. Villegas, yes! Medyo out of position pa si Villegas doon ha. But she managed to bring that ball down. Pangkat kasi, saka mahaba yung reach. Mahaba ng arms, oo. She went over the blocker. One point lead para sa Lady Defenders. That serve is good. Waga, tinubid ang bola. It could have been outside, yeah. pero kinuha pa. Villegas, back-to-back -back points. Tinatarget ni ni Villegas, si Cruz. Eh. Oh, pinapagod. Kasi, oh, pinapagod, correct. So that when they put that ball up, at siya ang mag-atak, eh, kukulangin na siya ng hangin. Seven points para kay Villegas. Lahat sa set na to. Ah. She did not play. Ah, actually, she played in the opening set. Uh, short lap. So, naka eight points na to si Villegas in total. After that kill block, no opening set. Seven points naman dito sa second set. Serving uh, Charity Bejarin. Pinangat ni Inid. Pantanosas. Waga, keeping it alive. Chance ball para sa Lady Defenders. Villegas over receive. Villegas gets it. Jiwan Lai. Pangilinan. Papalo. Waga will set. Villegas with the receive. Villegas back row. Yes. Although nakaputos doon ang Senate, ha, si Coach Roger still telling, ano, telling Pat Villegas where to push that ball. Two point eight para sa Senado. Eight six. Hindi sila makawal, makawala, no? Makalayo masyado din dito itong Lady Defenders. Juwelay to Gallares into the net. Well, marami rin kasi sila errors to win yan. Oo. Kaya makaka-under sila. Makakaroon ng advantage. Nasa stop. Oo. So, one point game tayo dito as Olavere nagbabalik. Here is the serve by Gobis. Pantanosas. Gallares inangat. Jewel Lai. Back to Gallares. Miss hit. Waga inangat. Oh! And yung attempt ni Gobis to save na punta sa mukha ni Olavere. Pero good effort doon by the emissaries. You would rather see that as a coach kesa sa yung tinitingnan lang yung bola bumagsak. Dalawa ulit ang kalabangan ng Lady Defenders, Jewel Lai. Oh! Wow. And if you're Coach Coronel, hindi ka happy sa ganun, no? I mean, Jewel Lai, varsity player to mula nung high school, both Christian High to UP and then to Benilde. A long service error para kay Jewel Lai. Pero babalik naman. Oh, pag it's service error, hindi mo talaga titingnan Coach Coronel. Hiyake. 
Eileen Sio with the service error. Puntahan natin si Ira Pablo. Coach Roger pointed out the differences between their game against Ombudsman and their game today. Um, for Ombudsman, he felt like they had complete control over that one. Sila yung unang lalamang, tapos didikit. And they felt like they had the momentum for that game. Pero para naman dito sa DFA, late na nila nahanap yung kanilang rhythm in this game. And then they had early struggles during that set. And right when he needed her the most, pinasok niya si Kat Villegas for the first time in order to close out that set. So that's the kind of tough love that uh, Kat and Coach Roger shares. Alam mo yung magkatinginan sila. There's already an instant connection. Na sila. So, um, Coach Roger really heavily relies on Kat, but there's just some things that he expects talaga from her in this game. Malik sa inyo. Alright, maraming salamat, Ira. Nung, uh, after the first set nga, yung last game nitong uh, Senado kontra sa uh, Ombudsman, nilabas si Kat Villegas, so she didn't come back uh, the entire second set. Tinanong ko si assistant coach Kate Malonzo, sabi ko na injure ba si Kat? Sabi niya, hindi, masama na ang laro. Oh. So, yun nga, I mean, because so much expectation. Uh, alam nila Coach Roger na if you're not playing up to the standard na alam ko, lalabas muna kita. Villegas. Ito si Waga. Iaangat ang bola. Cruz. Block. And save is no good. And DFA. Si Cruz tinitignan niya eh. Uh, si Kat Villegas no. Tinitignan niya kailan tatalun to. Kaya... We're tied at 11. Villegas. Nice placement by Villegas. No need to jump there. Serving now is Eve. Villegas, 10 points na to. Double digits, Scott Villegas. Good up. Ball is out. Well, ball. Di talaga makalayo dito ang Senado because of uh, errors. Cruz, a good serve. Juelai, pare pangilinan will hit and score. Alam mo, ito, their approach was a little late kaya naging niya ng top spin eh. and he did the job. Pangilinan. First point. Ang mga senado ng isa. 13 serving 12. Second set. Waga. Short sa tip. Yeah, that was a good strong serve by Villegas. Ito ngayon ang uh, kailangan natin patayan. So look at the crowd inside the Paco Arena. Two point lead ulit sa senado. Can they get a good serve in? Yun lang oh, na. Wow. Ito talaga yung parang hump eh. Hindi no? sila maka, makalampas sa two-point advantage kasi nag e sila. Pasok na ngayon si Pelito. Cruz, nagtataka ba? Bakit ako ilalabas? Oh. Kita mo sa mukha niya eh. No? A ako ba? Uh, Tipito, may babalik sa game. Cruz with eight points. Tipito with nine, uh, seven. Seven points in the game. Tala Charity Bejerin will serve. Looking to tie the game. Villegas. Nice. Si Villegas is a threat in front, which is also a threat at the back. On oh. sina, para kay Kat Villegas. A threat din siya sa service zone. <laughs> Two point lead ulit para sa Senado. Uh, big serve coming up para kay Pangilinan. Waga sets it. Pepito, back row. Oh. Short. Oh, she was off position when she uh, jumped for that ball. Three-point lead para sa Senado. This is their biggest lead in set number two. Waga will set. Villegas, back row. Pepito with the dig. Waga. And short, uh, si Irene Sio. Sa palo, so back-to-back -back attack errors. Cheeky para sa emissaries. Oh, and ngayon, papasok na si Dili Dili. 
sabi ng producer to. Pero tawag ko na time out. Si Coach Gatarosa, pahinga natin ang emissaries. Ano mo eh? Sa tapat, kira sa likod, pwede tayo palagi. Alam na lang pinadarating sa atin eh. Diba? Ay, papalo, palo. Tatawin mo, okay? Huwag mo ibibaby, ha? Huwag mo ibibaby. Kaya mo naman eh. Tatawin mo kung palo, okay? Jack, yung set, huwag mo sa atin ilapit sa rin. Tapos itaas mo lang. Ha? Huwag ang pangalan, ha? Ha? Okay? Okay, okay. Ito na pinakamalaking kalamangan ng Major Defenders kontra sa MSIs. Kaya napatawag na tayo mga si Coach Gandarosa. Isa 4-point lead. Pero makailangan gawin nila dito, Chiki. Sabi nga ni Coach Butch, eh, yung, yung mga attacks ng Senate, palobo. So kailangan yung mga backliners on their toes, ready to receive the ball. Tapos yung set, usually, ito, it's, it's like a rule, no? Pag halimbawa maliit yung player or hindi katangkaran, huwag masyadong malapit sa net. Kasi it will be more difficult for her to hit that ball well. Kaya may kanya-kanyang comfort zones. No? So dapat alam ng setter yun. Pangilinan serving. Lamang ng apat ang Senado. Waga, underhand, pass, siyo. Partially blocked by Pantanosas. Ito si Dili Dili. Short! So DFA ngayon may advantage sila with, with their coming up serve. Francis B. Gobis is serving para sa emissary sa high serve. Pantanosas mula sa gitna. Olavere, aatake. Back row, Villegas. Outside, now it's on the line. Ang ganda ng arm swing, ang ganda ng approach. Fast arm swing, kaya ang ganda ng ano, pagkahit niya ng ball. Look at that. Pahinga natin itong report ni Ira Pablo. If you take a look at uh, Jane De Leon's left eyebrows, you're going to see a cut right there. She suffered a small accident in the office earlier. Pagbukas daw niya ng pinto, tumama daw sa mukha niya. But of course, she's not gonna let a small cut stop her from showing up for her team today. Malik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Ira. Ayan eh, ang uh, mentality ng fighter. Oo, oh, yan ang player, di ba? Competitor. Mag kahit na may sakit, naglalaro. Oof. Tip for tap lang, no? Sa services, service errors. Balik sa apat, kalamangan ng Lady Defenders. Ito si Ellen Pantanosas. Works at the Commission on Appointments. Outside. Para sa Senado, o oh, tunuha. The uh, Bobis, big by Pangilinan. Good coverage mula sa likod. Para kay Nalve. Overpass. Olivera picking it up. Waga. Ito. Oh. Nicely done. Bad pass to Waga. Hindi pipito. Hindi nilipito niyo bola eh. Oh, kasi that ball went to the open plane, uh, which is on top of the tape. Meron ano dun eh, free zone. Hindi ka tatawagan ng overreaching dun. So, lima, kalamangan ng Lady Defenders' biggest lead dito sa set na ito. Waga sends it over. Free ball para sa Lady Defenders. Villegas. Yes! Ganda wow. ng connection ni Drew Alay at saka ni Kat Villegas. 14 na to. Ni Kat Villegas, 13 dito sa second set. She's getting whatever she wants. Six-point lead para sa Lady Defenders. Another bad pass and an easy point. 15 para kay Villegas. Ito na, last time out. Ni Coach Gandarosa, pakinggan natin ang emissaries. Second ball, isa pa sabi yung kanina, ilayo sa net. Tayo na puro lapit sa net na nangyayari. Bawi tayo, bawi, bawi. Harap lang, harap lang. Kaya pa yan, kaya pa yan. Harap lang. Taas na yung bola, taas. Kahit i-pass nyo na lang, huwag nyo na ilapit sa net. Go, go! Bye! Mahirap din kasi kapag yung bola malapit sa net, tapos nasa harapan si Kat Villegas. She's gonna take advantage of that. It's gonna be an easy point for for the Senate. Seven point lead para sa Lady Defenders. They are playing much, much better dito sa second set.
Pantanosas serving. Papahinga si Gomez. As uh, Robbie Baltasar is back in the game para sa emissaries. Ugh. That could have been outside. Yeah, I thought it was outside. Tinuha ni Aileen Sio. Juwelay, inangat. Inid passes Villegas. Oh, off the shoulder. Oh, of off her shoulder. Oh, yeah. uh, Villegas quickly apologizes. Okay daw siya, sabi ni Oliver. This is a ease. Para kay Villegas, 15 doon, Chiki. Dito sa second set. Wow. Pantanosas. Two points away ang Senado from a win dito sa second set. Overpass. Waga binalik agad on the first touch. Villegas sets it. Dili Dili! Oh! Really struggling today, uh, Dili Dili. Uh, only two points kay Dili Dili, uh, but three errors. And three service errors. So, anim na errors kay Dili Dili. And she's only scored two points. Uh, Jackie Lou Waga samantala to serve. Oh, sure. Well, then, Iwaga, so it's going to be eight set points for the Senado. 24 16, the second set. I thought see Dili Dili getting ready to serve. My three service errors. Ito, well, she gets that one in. Waga. Oh, short. Back to back errors. Man, but Iwaga gives Senate the. What is this? Nine point win. Dito sa. Second set. Yeah. Namis calculate ni Waga yung ano eh, yung distance niya sa net. And I think the height also. So, pero Kat Villegas, what a yeah. second set for her. Huh? She delivered the different kinds of attacks, showing us the, the diversity in her attacks. That's a monster performance in set number two. One point the first set, pero 15 points sa second set. Para kay Kat Villegas, there she is. Matala, second in the scorer, si Cecilio with seven. Pero lahat yun para kay Cecilio in the opening set. Oh. So, tingnan natin this third set. Makakalaro pa kaya ulit si Villegas or papapahinga siya ni Coach Roger. So, matala para sa DFA. Charmaine Cruz with eight points, Pepito with nine. Pero no other player with more than two points pagkatapos noon. Senate leading two sets to nothing contra sa DFA. Senate Lady Defenders contra sa DFA Emissaries. And you can see here, ang Senate has already won two sets uh, against the DFA Emissaries. And ito yung kwento nung second set, no? Uh, 17 attack points coming from the Lady Defenders. Tatlo lang ang naproduce ng Emissaries because um, talagang yung mga, yung mga services ng Senate proved to be very difficult for DFA to put the ball up. So, talagang kinontrol ng Lady Defenders yung, yung play na yon, yung set na yon. And Kat Villegas in the second set really produced a lot of the much-needed points. Uh, ang ganda ng hugot ni Coach Rogers sa kanya. Uh, the DFA, eto no, binabalase, binabalasen no, ni, ano, ni Coach Butch ang kanyang team to find out kung what's a good mix. And uh, let's see if they can produce a better set in this third. Right now, may kita ko sa court si Pepito at saka si uh, Cruz. Sila ang opposite, parang yung first set. Si Olivera is there. Uh, dito naman sa kabila, sa Senate, balik si Cecilio. Pahinga muna si um, Jualay at saka si Kat Villega. So si Palarca at saka si uh, Cecilio ang imports ngayon for the Senate. 
Ito na, mag-uumpisa na ang third set. TFA needs the set to stay alive. At kung gustong umuwi na maaga ng Senate, tatapusin na nila to in three sets. So up to serve now is Chuck Cruz. Cruz right now, uh, top scorer para sa emissaries with eight points, five from attacks, three aces. Palabra ka, nagbabalik para sa Lady Defenders, kasama si Cecilio. And palabra ka, knocks it in. What a way to start that set, no? Palabra ka, ano, delivering a fast hit. Palabrica with four points. And serve. Wala kay Karandan. That hit. May check ball. So, Pepito, two puntos. That's uh, eight point para kay Pepito. Long, long serve. Diyan kay Wally Bantasan. Oh, kita mo kasi, pagtawid niya ng net, hindi pa bumababa yung ball eh. That's why you know it's gonna go outside. Samantala Grace Palabrica, coming off a 14-point performance. Quiet day para sa kanya. Only 4 points so far, but a nice serve. Pepito, easy over. Felipe will set it. Ito si Cecilio. Pepito with a dig. Cruz back to Pepito. Cut shot. Picked up by Cerezo. Cerezo, papalo. Ganda ng dalaw ngayon ng DFA. Maganda no yung combination when Pepito and Cruz are both inside. Maganda yung dalaw nila. Attack error para kay Cerezo. Ties the game. Two all. Felipe, tatawid ang bola. One, two, play. Cruz. Pepito. Good pass, Felipe. Cecilia with the tip. Acosta Capili in and out. Cruz back to Pepito with the push. Felipe. Uh, Cecilia. Yes! Palagay ko kung hindi na kuha yun ni Acosta Capili, that would have gone out. It, it seemed quite wide. Oh, no? Palapas din kasi. So, Senado, lalamang nag-isa. As Cerezo serving. Cruz, Cruz, mula sa back row. Cecilio magseset para kay Dili Dili with a push. Eto kay Pepito to. Strong hit. But Palabrica with a great dig. Magagawan. Pepito and Cruz. Chance ball. Felipe will set it. They go back to Cecilio. Off speed. Cruz back to Pepito. Cecilio picking it up. Ito si Cecilio. Atake! It's outside. I think ang target niya was the corner of zone 5. Eh. Malapit na siya doon. Eh. Konting kabit na lang. So, sa error ng Senado. The game is tied. problem ang service for both teams. Madaming uh, attack errors or errors, unforced errors coming from the service zone for both teams. In terms of attack errors, ano, 14 para sa uh, emissaries, 10 para sa Senado. Wow, taas. Ganun kadami. Felipe with a nice serve. Cruz. Pepito in ang atambola. A nice hit by Karandang. Cruz with the push. Picked up by Dili Dili. Inatrasan ni Dili Dili. Pepito, back to Cruz. Yes! Yeah. Again, you can see the arm swing there of Pepito. I guess na nakakatulong din yung experience niya sa beach volleyball, no? For all! Dili-dili, inangat for Palabrica. Nice. 
Good floor defense para dito sa emissaries. Cerezo with a bad first touch of a big. Kaya ang emissaries talabang ng isa, 5-4. Tinignan muna ni Cruz eh, kung saan niya pwedeng dalhin yung bola and she saw that zone one was open so that's where she put the ball. Oh! oh. Third is way off para kay Rachel Abarientos. Ito yung kanina pa, no? Yung story. Lalamang tapos biglang masastop dahil sa service error. Six service errors para sa DFA. Palo is good for Cruz. Si, si Cruz, iba-iba yung location ng kanyang mga palo. Kanina zone 1, ngayon naman zone 5, opposite. So, may, mahirap siya bantayan, kaya dapat binabasa yung kamay at saka yung shoulders kung saan nakaharap. First double-digit scorer para sa emissaries, Charmaine Cruz with 11. Palabrika outside. Ito, kumakawala na ang emissaries. Laman ng dalawa. Acosta Capini with the underhand serve. Cerezo with a bad first ball. Tatlo na ang kalabangan ng emissaries. The biggest lead of the set. An underhand serve there. Pero yun nga eh. Even if it's an under, underhand, it's still best to receive a serve uh, with your uh, no, plank. A good save by Olavere. Felipe Iaangat for Palabrica. Nice. Good big. Oh! Uh, that's it. The puntos ang Senado. Maganda sana yung reception, no? Kasi natanggap mataas yung lipad ng bola. But it was sharp. Napapunta sa net. So it was... Proved to be a little difficult for the other teammates to put that ball up. Dili Dili serving 6 8. This is a third set. Cruz short. One point game. Dili Dili may chance to tie on this serve. May one ace na si Dili Dili. They got two aces. Again, no, si Dili Dili, ano to, contributor to ng Senyan. So you have to watch out for her as well. Three points para kay Jamilin Dili Dili who had eight points ng uh, four set win nila kontra sa Ombudsman. Nice, sir. Back to back aces para kay Jamilin Dili Dili. Uh, three aces, four points. And sa isang iglap na wala yung kalabangan ng DFA 4-0 run para sa Senado pakinggan natin timeout ni Coach Gandarosa yung first 5 points nila puro service error natin ha? okay may seat time mabuti ha stay low okay be ready ha tapos pag nakita nyo nagsaset na sila hindi lumayo na kayo di ba lumayo na kayo kasi naiilang eh service errors. The first five points na na earn ng Senate was really from their service errors. So, sabi nga niya, to be able to receive the attacks and their services, they have to stay low. Yun yung, di ba, lagi natin sinasabi eh. You can actually really tell where the ball is going to go pag malapit ka sa ground. Kaya makikita mo, especially in international competitions, low to the ground yung mga players. Kasi they need to calculate, they need to know where that ball's gonna go. And then, very important, na may coverage. Pinimindin yun ni Coach Butch. Huwag papabayaan yung coverage. Senado, lamang ng isa. Pagkatapos ang two straight aces ni Dili Dili, uh, service error. Yeah, on that, the note, timeout, served good for DFA. Na-break yung momentum ni Dili Dili. Oh. Matala. Uh, serving Charmaine Cruz, 9-all, third set.
Pero ang emissaries down two sets to nothing. Felipe to Palabrica. Pinangat ni Cruz. Olivera sets it. Pepito atake. It is just outside. Puntahan natin si Ira Pablo courtside. Sheila Cecilio shared with me that she comes from a family of athletes. So from her parents down to her and her siblings, lahat sila merong sport. Originally, hindi talaga siya nagsimula sa volleyball. In fact, she was a swimmer since she was grade 5. And she competed pa sa palarong pang bansa until she transitioned into volleyball when she reached high school. And then yun, nagtuloy-tuloy na siya sa sport na ito. Sa sport na to. But you know, the biggest challenge that uh, Sheila is facing right now is her time management. Because aside from being an athlete, she's also a mom to her daughter, Sam. So aside from managing a business, being an athlete, and being a mom, she uwi and pa yan sa Kalamba, Laguna. So really, hats off to all the mom athletes here of the UBL. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, wow. Ira. Marami ang dedication, ano? As a mom and to the sport. Grabe. You know, I could see na swimmer siya. Yung body niya, no? Yung uh -huh. shape ng body. Parang swimmer nga talaga. Wow, what a serve. What a serve. From Palabrica. Uh, Palabrica, that's gonna be her, her second service ace. Eight points para kay Grace Palabrica. Balik sa dalawa, kalamangan dito ng Senado. Another loaded serve. Better receive mula kay Pepito. Good dig para kay Dili Dili. Felipe to Cecilio. Cut shot. One-handed dig para kay Cruz. Overpass. Cecilio Binalit. Olavere back to Pepito. Oh, what a dive by Palabrica. And another save by Felipe. What a rally. Great coverage by the Lady Defenders. Pepito with a push. Felipe diving once again. Dili Dili. Cecilio Atake. Olavere with a dig. Cruz to Pepito. That's outside. Wow, good movement from the Senate. Kita mo si Cecilio, ikot siya ng ikot, no? Uh, watching the net, going back, preparing yourself for the attack. And she's such a leader in the court. Pero we have to mention yung defensa ni Felipe. Yes. Twice to keep the ball alive uh -huh. para sa Lady Defenders. Dala yun, inangat. Gonna be a free ball. Dili Dili, Felipe will set it up. Cecilio, atake with a push. Yes! Smart move there by Cecilio. And what a second ball from Felipe. Underhand shot, but I you know. Look at that. Underhand set, close to the net. Gave a chance for Cecilio to just tip that ball over. Biggest lead para sa Lady Defenders. Four oh. points. Pero yung serve into the net. Para kayong Palabrica. Ito, Michelle Olivera, the team captain. Cecilio. Nangapi Cruz. Pepito will set it up. Felipe. Cecilio. Nangapi Olivera. Cruz. Good save. That could be four touches. Pero walang pinito. Uh -oh. Ating first referee si Ryan Corpus. So continue lang. Whew. Great movement by the officials. Pero kinapos yung angat ni Pepito. Alam mo, importante rin talaga sa volleyball yung stamina and endurance. Kasi siya kapag ikaw yung go-to player, di ba? Sa'yo lagi nabibigay yung bola. Ay, yung takbuhan sa pag-igot na yun sa rally. Ang haba nun, ha? Oo. Ang talang substitution. As Deliosa will check in for the first time. Papatan si Cerezo. Karina Deliosa scored one point contra sa Ombudsman on their last game. Cruz Inangat. Acosta Capili with a hit. Cecilio. Olavere with a nice dig. Here's Pepito. Inangat ni Palabrega. Felipe. Cecilio. Uh, Olavera, great coverage sa likod. Oh, but, hindi maganda yung pasa ni Baltasar. Chance ball. Dili Dili. With the push. It's outside. Oh. So frustration ni Dili Dili na pag-apit siya sa net eh. E bawal yun. <laughs> Nag-sorry naman siya sa first ref. Three 
point game. Nice serve. Good dig, though. Dili Dili, Babawe. It's outside. Back to back attack errors for Jibelin Dili Dili. Pepito serving 13 15. Third set. Nice serve. Nice, yeah. That's got to be a nice. Para sa Evan Series, tatawa ng Taiwan, Coach Roger Goroyev. Paano mo na pag ganun pa rin? Kaya madaling kuhain, tapos natatapat doon sa maruno. Tapos babalikan tayo ng palo, bakit natin sila papapaloy? Tayo ang papalo. Ah, bumaba ka dito. Huwag ka dito, ay sorry, huwag ka dito tumayo. Andiyan si Grace eh. Ang sinasabi ko sa inyo, bumaba ka rito. Wala namang violation no, wag lang kayo maglalampas, wag lang mauuna si Grace. Para may re-receive talaga. Okay? Huwag okay, okay. kayo magsaping dalawa, maghiwalay kayo. Sige. Kailangan nga talaga, no? first ball, receive muna. At ang sabi nga ni Coach eh, na dapat kung titira tayo ng bola, dapat hindi yung palobo, yung easy for the other team to set the ball up. So kailangan papaluin nila yung bola. Hindi nila hihintayin yung DFA ang papalo ng bola. So it's a one-point game. Nice hit, but a good dig. Para kay Deliosa. Cecilio sends it over. And another point para sa Senado. Ganda rin ang ginawa ni Cecilio dun eh. Na-intimidate tuloy si Cha when she went up for the last hit. Kita niya si Cecilio to go up for the block. Nagdalawang isip si Cruz. Coming from the back row with a strong crossbar hit. Three point game. Felipe serving 17 14. Nice up. Acosta Capili, Maganda Pacatabit the Bola. Not a good pass there by Caranda. Oh, but. Parang, uh, there's somebody cramping up para sa Emissaries. Uh, is that Robbie Baltasar? So in the meantime, habang inihintay natin yun, no, the Senate, Lady Defenders can group together and then they can talk kung ano yung kailangan nilang gawin para matapos itong set na to dahil dalawa lang ang lamang nila sa emissaries. It's Rachel Abarientos who's cramping up and she's getting attention mula sa ating UNTV News and Rescue Team. We're always here to make sure that all the players are looked after in yeah. case may mga gantong instances. Ang bilis nila mag-react to. Of course. That kaka ano lang kaka bulog lang or bagsa kaka upulang ng ating player and they were quick to respond in wheelchair agad ang galeng matagal tagal din siyang on board di ba and the on the floor so she's gonna get wheeled to the sideline for more treatment mula sa ating UNTV News and Rescue Team she's gonna be a okay it's just a cramp so fluids fluids lots of water kung may banana di ba kung may banana Okay. Uh, still a ball game here. Kaya kaya tong habuli ng emissaries. They're only down by three. Make that two points. Uh, 17 15. 
third set. But the problem for the emissaries, they are down two sets to nothing. So must-win situation sila ngayon right. in set number three. Felipe Yaangat. Dili Dili. Picked up by Pepito. Cruz back to Pepito. And you've got to expect a lot of Pepito, a lot of Cruz para sa emissaries late in this third set. And si Pepito, eh, pag nanggaling siya from the back, ang ganda ng takbo niya towards the ball. It creates a momentum for her. Felipe. To Cecilio. Uh, Pepito, eto. Sabi natin, uh, mostly Pepito and Cruz ang ahawak dito para sa emissaries to get back in this game. One point game. Ito naman si Cruz ang atake ngayon. Cecilio with the up. Nice. Dili Dili. Cruz. Sa kabilang banda naman, puro Cecilio ang papalo dito and Cecilio makes it a two point game. Cecilio targets the middle talaga eh, sa likod, no? Back middle. Para mahirap kunin yung bola. There you go. This isn't the first time eh. Twice or three times yun yung nagawa yun. Let's go to Ira Pablo for this report. Coach Butch Gandarosa emphasized the importance of boosting the morale of his players, especially being down 0-2. to two. He told them to keep their head held high because there are a lot of things to be proud of, especially with the improvement that they showed during the past few games. But now that they are down 0-2, to they really have to double up the effort and stay in the course of the game. Balik Marami salamat, Ira. Well, right now, they are giving the Lady Defenders a good fight. Yeah. It's a close game. Isa lang ang kalabangan dito ng mga nakaputi. Dili-dili on the attack. Cruz saves it. Save. Felipe, they go back to Palabrega. Cruz with a up. Olavere, back to Cruz. Cecilio to Dili-dili. Outside. And yung kalamangan ng Senado, nawala na. We're tied at 18. Alam mo si Coach Butch kasi, talagang believes in encouraging the other, encouraging his players to do better. And that's exactly what they're doing. Acosta Kapili to serve and try to put the emissaries on top. Ito, pagkakataon. Cruz. It is on the line. Pinabayaan ni Torres Roque. And yun na nga. Emissaries on top by one, 19-18. Ito yung sinabi ni Coach Roger Kalina, yung mga bola ng emissaries, they're not that strong, but they're long. So they have to watch out for those. It is a 5-1 to one run para sa DFA to take the lead. Pepito to Cruz. Ay! Masakit yun. Oo, oh, masakit yun para kay Cruz. They're going for a two-point lead. Instead, tie tie at 19. See Coach Roger Correa, as we look at the lineup and uh, defenders, sticking with Cecilio and yeah. Palabrica in this entire third set. Walang Kat Villegas, walang Juwalay. Oh. Uh, short para kay Olavere. And lalabang ang Senado. Off that error by Olavere. Cerezo magbabalik. At papaltan si Karina Deliosa. Dili Dili. Uh, with three aces already. Nice serve. Pepito. Back to Cruz. Off speed. Pinangat ni Palabrica. Karandang sends it over. Oh, nagagawa ni Olavera and Pepito. And just like that, a three-point run naman para sa Lady Defenders and their backup. Uh, 21, uh, 19. Cardinal Julian, eh, second ball setter. setter. Uh, unless tumawag siya ng help, wag na wag niyong kukunan ng second ball. Uh, good serve. Yeah. Bad Go first on. ball para kay Pepito. Ito, easy over. Pagkakataon umatake para sa lady defenders. They go to Palabrega. Yes! Palabrega. Ano siya eh, in front, reliable player for the seven. 4 0 run naman para sa Senado to get back on top by three. Timeout, Coach Gantarosa. Pahingin natin ang DFA Emissaries. Tulong, tulong.
Guys, tulong na kaunti kay Ma'am Ao. Ha? Sa kanya dinadala yung bola. Kita-kita natin, di ba? Ha? Okay? Pizza. Come on, come on. Kaya pa yan, kaya pa yan. Kaya pa yan. Kasi nga naman, di ba, kung ikaw yung star player or highest pointer in your team, gusto mo, kung ikaw yung kalaban, papagurin mo siya. Oh. Para pag sinetap sa kanya, walang hangin. O kaya yung palo niya, hindi na ganun kalakas. And yun yung sinabi ni Coach Butch, kailangan tulungan si Pepito. Big serve, coming up. Oh, it's oh. outside! Muntik na ang hawakan! <laughs> ni Molly Nalve, pero buti na lang, pinabayaan niya. Hindi ko alam kung sa Java yun, <laughs> or... <laughs> o oh, nagkamali na talaga, hindi niya na kung... Pero, however, yep. puntos pa rin sa kanila. Two-point game. Malak, malak, malak. Oh! Sasabihin ko sana, maliit lang itong hinahabon na, na MSRs, pero sa service error na yun, lumaki. And talagang... I mean, it's just three points, pero malaki to because two points na kailangan ng Senado. Tatlo hinahabol ng DFA. Important sir to para kay Karandang. At ay, tawag! Oh! Gets wow! an ace of an underhand serve and it's four match points para sa Senado. Ang ganda ng serve na yun. It barely went over. They were just so close to the game. Bukang hindi ang abot eh. Karandal, that's her first ace. Oh, that second ace, back-to-back -back aces. Para kay Marla Katrina Karandal. And that's a five-point win para sa Senado in set number three. En route to a three-set win contra sa DFA. Ang ganda ng hukot ni Coach Roger for the last few points. Karandal did not disappoint. And, you know, Kat Villegas was uh, an instrument talaga dun sa second set nung, uh, uh, nung pinasok siya. 